And I heard the Lord say this morning, how long will my people, they've been of two minds and two hearts. They love me one day and the next day <laughs> they're loving something else. They're of two mindsets. They switch between their thoughts on me and their thoughts on other things. And this is why they haven't received because you can't be of two mindsets. You can't be of two hearts or you will not receive what I have for you in your life. <laughs> They've been like swingers. They swing from one lover to another. They think that I, I'm a God that shares. I want all of their heart. It can't be just a little bit of me here and a little bit of me there. I want all their heart, all their mind. For my word says, you shall love the Lord thy God with all your heart, mind, and soul. But they only want to give me a little part and then expect me to bless them. Did I give you a little part? Or did I give you my whole life? I sacrificed everything. I sacrificed my time in heaven to come and be with you. And you won't take the time to be with me every day. I laid my life down for you. And you won't even lay down the remote. I'm calling my people back to have a heart after me, not to be half hearted lovers, not be swinging from one lover to the next. That may work in the world, but I must have your whole heart, because that's what I gave you. I must have your whole heart. I cannot be in an adulterous relationship with you. You can't love the world and its pleasures and love me. you got to love me with your whole heart. You know, weep over my people because they've been playing the harlot. They come to church, but behind closed doors, they're with other lovers. And they think I don't see, they think that I don't see what they do, <laughs> but I see everything. I see everything that you do. How can you enter my heaven when your bride clothes are stained? For surely I shall have a wedding feast, but you will not enter into the bedchamber when you've been with others. You will not enter that bedchamber of intimacy with me. And I ask you, when I return, will you be ashamed? Will you be caught in adultery with the idols of this land? Will you be caught in adultery and fornication because you bow to the things? You must repent and return to me with your whole heart to your first love.
for I have nothing to do with someone who swings between two opinions.